Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I will be sharing the products that I got in the January 2021 nail boxy monthly box subscription. So if you'd like to see what the contents were in the box for this month, stay tuned. So today I'll be sharing this new to me subscription box called Nail Boxy. Well, I guess it's not really new to me because I have seen it around on Instagram and I really, really wanted to give it a try. So basically it's like I said, a subscription box and you get five to ten large sized items per month and each month it varies what you get in the box. So this is the box for January. And the theme for this month is bio seaweed. So bio seaweed gel and you're gonna get five to ten large sized items from them. As you can see, this month there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine items, and then you get a little thank you card with a discount code for you to use on the Bio Seaweed Gel website. And I'm super happy because you don't pick the colors that you get in your box, it's randomly chosen. And guess what? I got some purple colors, so I'm super, super excited. So let's take a look at these. So first I'll be starting off with the files and the buffers. So they included like a nail file. Obviously you would use this to file and shape your nails, which is always good because I can never have too many nail files. And I always find like I'm buying them a lot. So I'm glad that I actually have another one to add. And then you've got this large buffer. So you've got your 180 side and your 100 side. So let's basically use two file, shape, buff, um, remove any shine and anything like that. So you've got the large size one and then they give you two mini ones. So in this month, we also got their new and improved base. So usually you would use this like when you're doing any type of manicure you put on your base, then your color, and then your top coat. But they've actually changed the formula on this from my understanding because I actually had their base and top gel and both of them used to be in a black bottle but now it seems like their base and their top is in the white bottles and their colors and whatnot are in the regular black bottles. And as I was saying, this is their new and reformatted um, no white top coat as well so as you can see like I said the base and the top come in this new like pearlescent white bottle so moving on to the colors you get one all-in-one gel color one three-step gel color and then a matching nail polish color so this is a two-in-one set usually so you get the gel and the polish color so I'll be starting off with the Unity All-in-One. So this is Sequin. So the All-in-Ones usually it combines the base and the top coat. But it's up to you. You can use a base and a top coat if you want to. But the way that these ones are set, you don't necessarily have to. Me personally, I would still go in with my base, color, and top. But again, it's up to you. <music> So this is one coat of sequin and it's a like silver gray and there's some really really beautiful gold shimmer in this polish as well it's very very pretty again not a color i usually gravitate towards but i could see myself wearing this i can actually see quite a few people i know wearing this so i'm excited to try it on them as well so this is just one coat i am gonna go in with a second coat just because i can see some sheerness right at <laughs> As you can see this was really opaque with the second coat so you would really only need two coats to get full opacity with this color and here's what sequin looks like against my skin tone such a lovely cool toned gray i really really like this color. and the next color i have to share with you is passion so this is from their three-step color collection so this is where you would need to put your base because it's not included in the gel color and your top as well 
and usually with the bio seaweed gel polishes you do get like an idea of what the color is going to be like when you open the bottle which is really really nice too. This is a mauve lilac y color. I'm getting some pink undertones from it, but it's so very nice still. And this is one coat, guys. So I actually might just leave it at one coat because it's pretty opaque. And here is what Passion looks like against my skin tone. Very, very delicate color. It's still really, really nice. And surprisingly, it's showing up true to life in my camera, which I really love. And this is the exact same color as the gel Passion, but just in a regular nail lacquer. <laughs> And this is Passion the Nail Lacquer in one coat. I would go in with a second coat because I can see like the tack that I'm using to hold the nail tip in place with just a bit under the nail. So I would go in with a second coat. And lastly, I'll be sharing the Artiste Gel from Bio Seaweed. So this is supposed to be like a blooming gel, if I'm not mistaken. Never used it before, so I'm really excited to give this a try. And it gives you the instructions on the back of the box. So it says, you would prep your nails as regular, apply your base, and you are not required to apply any bonders if you're using their base. And then you apply one to two coats of the color gel. I want to know if I can use this with other gels or only with their gel. So I'm going to play around with it and see. And then you would, after you've cured the gel color that you're using, you would apply the artist gel and don't cure it. Then you'll use a dotting tool or a brush and begin to draw your nail art design and don't cure it yet. Then you can watch as it automatically self levels and comes to life after a few seconds. Once you've achieved your desired look, you can cure it for 30 seconds with a LED light or one minute with a UV light. And then you finish with your top coat. So I actually can't wait to give this a try. I really want to play around with it. So maybe I'll do a video with me playing around with it and seeing what I can come up with. But I've seen a lot of people use like blooming gels and you can get some really, really neat effects with it. And here we have it for the January 2021 nail boxy subscription box. Honestly, guys, I really liked what I got so far. To me personally, I think subscription boxes are always a nice way to try things from different brands that you may be interested in trying but not sure if you really want to invest in them or you just want to try something new but you're not sure who to try. So me personally, I've always loved subscription boxes. The fact that you get between 5 to 10 large size items is also really, really great as well. So let me know what your thoughts are. Do you like subscription boxes? Is this something that you'd be interested in? I can't wait to see what is going to be in store for the February box. I really, really like the colors that they sent, which is nice too. I mean, some people might prefer to be able to pick their own colors. Me, personally, I don't really care because it's always nice to have colors that you wouldn't try or you wouldn't lean towards because it's not always about you, right? I mean, it should be, but it's not. So I will have everything linked down below for you as well. Thank you so much guys for watching this video and tuning in with me. As always, please do give this video a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will get notified when I do post more content. As always, please leave any comments and questions down below and I will make sure to get back to you as soon as possible. Until the next one, stay glamorous.